Welcome back to another episode of Who the F***. It's the show that aims to take a deep dive into some of the acts announced for Reading and Leeds 2019. In today's video, we're looking at Bad Child. He's a kind of R&B pop star from Canada. If you've never heard of him before, hopefully this video will help answer the question, Who the F*** is Bad Child? say this will help you answer the question who they are I I don't really know who they are there's no out of all the interviews I've seen there's no name of, of, of bad child so I doubt he was christened bad child but he could be he's from Kitchener Ontario Canada that's not too far from Toronto and genre wise I would be describing him as kind of like a dark alternative pop meets R&B star reminds me a little bit of the weekend and everybody fucking everybody fucking that kind of um, direction vocals remind me of people like Tom Grennan or John Newman I keep searching and I can't seem to find Production reminds me of people like Totally Enormous Extinct Dinosaurs or James Blake or Jai Paul. Cause I could be the dog to your bone or something. But I think also you would you you'd be able to draw almost a bit of a comparison to people like Imagine Dragons. Get down with the victim! We both know you need them. I'm sure if Bad Child's watching this video, he'll tell me I'm wrong on every level here. <laughs> so usually I have like bullet points of different things that people have achieved in their uh, in their career when I do the bit about their story. Um, we're not even at like EP level with this guy. He released his first uh, single this year in January. It was also called Bad Child. Cut it out. <laughs> And it was a record that was produced by Spike Spent. He's known for working with people like Beyonce, Frank Ocean, The Yeah Yeah Yeahs, Grimes, Oasis, and The Spice Girls. And he has one of the strongest Grammy nomination lists out of anyone I've ever seen. The next single release was a song called Payback. And the most recent single was called Breathing Fire. He's working on his debut album entitled Free Trial, and he claims that it took him four years to make it. Earlier this year, he signed a deal with Virgin Records for releases in the UK and America, and with Universal Canada for releases in Canada. And we have a press release. Love these. Self-taught 19-year-old Canadian-born singer, writer, and producer, Bad Child, is looking to come to terms with his childhood. After losing his mother at a young age and dealing with heartbreak, he sought refuge from the world in music. Since then, he's been breaking new ground with his, with his genre bending and distinguished sound palette. His most popular song is the song Payback. Currently sat on 1.5 million hits on YouTube. And this will be his first time playing Reading and Leeds. He's currently taking to the Festival Republic stage on the Saturday, on the Friday at Reading, Saturday at Leeds, playing in between Dreamers and Jeremy Zucker. You know, musically, I really like his production sound. I think it sounds really great. I love those kind of like weird and wacky synthy parts. They really remind me of Totally and Almost Extinct Dinosaurs and, and Jai Paul. And I really like the kind of blends of genres. I don't think that on these three tracks alone that there's enough for me to get excited about his music. Although I I can see the potential there. It looks like maybe currently he's going to be clashing with the Night Cafe or Mini Mansions. Two bands that I'm increasingly uh, more excited to check out. So I think the chances of me going to check out his set are slim. That being said, if something comes out decent between now and then, then that could change it all. So on the likely to see scale, I'm going to go with a 2 out of 10. What do you think? Have you seen him perform before? Are you excited to check out his set at this year's festival? Um, a new, a very new artist, but... Um, one that isn't independent. A lot of backing from one of the big three, big four, big three. Can't remember what it is now. I'd love to know what you have to say. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below as always, and I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye.